Hello YouTube! Welcome back to Market Power today. We are gonna be opening these amazing new Pokemon tins. I just realized that these were perfect for today's occasion. So we're gonna do a little bit of a double upload today. I already uploaded another video. But we're gonna be doing two, two videos today. It is St. Patrick's Day today. And what better product to open than the Celebi Venusaur Tag Team GX Tin. The greenest product there is in Pokemon right now. With the Attack Evergreen GX. This is, I, I just, I was thinking about St. Patrick's Day and I saw, I was looking at my tins and I was like, yeah, this is perfect. I have to do it. Um, during, usually in St. Patrick's Day, people, um, consume a lot of alcohol beverages uh, but I, I didn't feel like that was exactly appropriate for this channel but opening these amazing new green tins definitely is something that I can do so we're gonna go ahead and crack these open I'm gonna fast forward to when I get all the contents out so stay seated and enjoy some music Alrighty then, now that we got all the products out, let's take a look at this beautiful, awesome new promo art. Oh my goodness. And it is definitely one of the coolest arts from the Tag Team series. And it's textured, which makes it even more better. Even better. More better? God, I can't speak English. Goodness! Alright, so it has the attacks Pollen Hazard, Solar Beam, and Evergreen GX. Super, super in theme with our St. Patrick's Day today. So, hopefully we can get some pretty lucky pulls. And man, I gotta say I love this artwork. The Celebi Venusaur is such a cool looking artwork and definitely one of my favorites from the new tag teams. So we got three of these. I'm gonna let them chill on the side here. And it comes with codes online that unlocks the Full Art GX online and a guarantee in the deck to play with. I'm not sure what the deck comes with, but it should, sounds like a pretty good time. So here you go. I'm gonna go ahead and give this to you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I am thinking about giving away more codes via private messaging. So make sure to leave a like, a thumbs up on the video if you guys are enjoying these tins so far. And let me know in the comment section below if you guys have bought these yet or are planning to. That's uh, that's the way I usually usually decide on who to give the codes to. I usually pick people from the comment section, so go ahead and do that if you want to win some codes. I got some Tag Team GX markers. Really love that they're giving these. They're really heavy, really good quality, and honestly loving it. They used to give these plastic ones, acrylic ones, and um, those, were, they, those worked fine, but these are just super cool. So we got the tins here, took everything out. We're gonna go ahead and put the tins onto the side. And we're gonna crack open these amazing packs. We're gonna go ahead and do evolutions first. Forbidden Light, then the two tag team packs. I feel like that's the, oh, hey, we have Venusaur. Well, the last, I don't think the last one's Venusaur. Ah, that would have been so fitting. I kind of want to do Venusaur's last, so let's do it this way. Man, that is so fitting. We got the Venusaur packs from Evolution. Sweet, all right. Crack into the first evolution pack. And let's see what we can get. Honestly, a lot of times, Pokemon does this where they throw in random X and Y packs. Another code for y'all amazing people, but um, they throw in a lot of ex extra X and Y packs that are super irrelevant to the current meta, the current, um, current, current, cap Oh my god, it's irrelevant, it's, people can't play it, but it's a Charizard. We're getting lucky here. Reverse Charizard and Eradicate. All right, all right. That's the best possible reverse you can get from the set. Oh my goodness. We're off to a fire start. Very nice. Reverse all the rare Charizard. Very, very nice indeed. Oh my goodness. Off to an excellent start. Onto Forbidden Light. 
I'm not saying Revolutions is not exactly a set people can play right now. It's not legal anymore. But it does have the Charizard like like we just saw. So I don't mind it at all. Three energy to the front. But it's when they start putting sets like Steam Siege and Fates Collide that I kind of scratch my head and I don't know. I don't really know what to think about it when they put in sets like that. Because they're, they're kind of forcing people to buy packs they don't want to. Reverse Fennekin and Toxicroak. Not too shabby. But I guess as long as they put majority, as long as the majority of the packs are relevant, I'm, I'm cool with that. Alright, on to team up. Here's a team up code. I don't usually give out codes like this, but on uh, on this occasion. Since it's St. Patrick's Day, I'm in the giving spirit. Alright, we got a lightning energy. Helioptile. Execute Ferocid. Meowth. Alolan Geodude. Ingo and Emmet. Tarmelian. Morgan. Ooh, Blastoise. Going with the Charizard, that's pretty awesome. Reaver's Hollow Rare Blastoise. And then the Lowland Ninetales, Hollow Rare. Not too shabby. All right, we're gonna go ahead and put these away. And on to the last team up pack. Let's see what we can get here. Hopefully something pretty sweet. Take the code card out. Try not to reveal what color it is, so it's a little bit more exciting. Leaf Energy, Volibee, Weedle, Helioptile, Execute, Ferocid, Kakuna Matata, Rapidash, Return Label, Reverse Hollow Lavender Town, and a Galvantula. Regular Rare. Alright, we do have these Reverse Hollow Rares and a Hollow Rare Night Tales from 10 number 1. So, not too bad at all. I do, I am really happy we got the Blastoise as well. Go with the Charizard and Blastoise is a pretty dope card. Um, it's pretty playable, pretty good deck on its own. So very happy we got that one. All right, on to tin number two. Hopefully we can get something sweet out of here. Evolutions again. So other some other other things that I really enjoy getting out of these evolution packs, aside from the Charizards, um, is the. Hollow energies. The hollow energies are pretty dope to pull. Full heal, Porygon, Reverse Switch. Not too bad. Oh, hey, what do you know? Gyarados Hollow Rare. That is pretty cool. That's a really cool uh, vintage Gyarados art there. Not too bad. On to Fates Collide. Not Fates Collide. Thinking Forbidden Light is Fates Collide. <sighs> Keep getting those two mixed up. Here's another code for y'all. Thank you so much for watching. Just go ahead and put the energy up front. You had a lot of great cards coming out of Forbidden Light. Um, you got Malamar, which is currently sitting at six bucks, I think. Just a, a regular rare Pokemon. Mysterious Treasures are like two dollars and a half, two fifty. Raccoonhead Reverse Hollow Rare Tyrantrum, and in Avalug. Regular bear. I guess the reverse bear sort of counts as a hit. All right, on to the good stuff. We got team up now. Hopefully, we can get some pulls from these team up packs because that's where we want the hits to come from. I'm still missing a ton of cards from the team up set, so hopefully, we can pull some something lucky here. We got a Zorua, Larvitar, Psyduck, got a Vola B, Weedle, Farfetch'd, Cosmoem. Oh, got something here. Dragon Nair, Re oh, not Reverse, Prism Star, Wondrous Labyrinth, and an Alolan Executor. Regular rare. Wondrous Labyrinth is pretty good. Now, for those of you who are interested in playing Pokemon competitively, this is good for a lot of decks that are trying to limit your opponent, trying to slow them down. Attacks of non fairy Pokemon cost an extra colorless energy. So that makes that gives a lot of decks some problems. Um, one of the most popular decks right now, Jirachi and Zapdos, they rely on the fact that they can attack very easily with a, with just a single energy on Zapdos. So once you throw that on there, it gives your opponent some problems. So just a little something something there. We got a Golduck, Grass Memory, Reverse Hollow Pangoro. And a Kabutops. Regular rare. Alright, so some decent pull. 
left from tin number two. Hopefully tin number three can make it up here and give us some real gold. Here's another code for yellow. Thank you so much for watching. Do the card trick three and two. All right, we got it, my chap. Needle ran, male and ponytail, drowsy, electabuzz, super potion, Brock's grit, maintenance, reverse hollow seal, and a dugong. How fitting. Cute little mama and baby seal. <laughs> All right, we're in light. Let's do this, my friend. One of the coolest cards from the set, in my opinion, is the secret, rare, mysterious treasure. That card looks gorgeous. Such a beautiful looking card, my goodness. All right, stick the energy out of here. Let's get doo doo. Doo biter, skater bug, ink. Ooh, could we get a Malamar here? That would be pretty awesome. Nope. Oh, another Tyrantrum reverse hollow rare. And a Torterra regular rare. All right, so we got two of those. Interesting. Very interesting. All right, last two packs team up. Hopefully these team up packs can uh, can uh, push it up a notch and give us some sweet sweet pulls for to celebrate St. Patrick's Day. Ooh, it's green for St. Patrick's Day. Not too shabby dabby. Got a Emilgum Reap, Vulpix, Joltik, Blitzel, Dublade, not too bad. Falafi, got a Morgan, Reverse Hollow Paris. Ooh, Incineroar. Reverse, I mean not reverse, Incineroar GX. All right, our very first ultra rare pull from these tins. All right, I was hoping for a little bit more ultra rare pulls, but um, hopefully this last Celebi Venusaur pack can come through for us here. All right, my friend, here we -a go. Let's go ahead and take the code card out. Here you go, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully we can get some last pack magic here and uh, pull some sweet cards for y'all to take a gander at. Lightning Energy, Magic Carp, OG and Alolan Geodude, Bronzor, Dratini, Evelyn, got a Nanu, Farfetch'd, ooh, Reaver's Hollow Rare Dragonite, and a Beedrill, regular rare. The Dragonite's pretty dope though. All right. So here are the pulls from our three Celebi Venusaur tins. Um, the highlight for me definitely is the Reverse Hollow Charizard. That is a sweet card to pull. Wondrous Live and Prince Star, not too bad. And Cinder GX, not too shabby dabby. We got some pretty cool Reverse Hollow and Hollow Rares to add to the collection. So not too bad there. Hopefully you guys are having an amazing St. Patrick's Day. Thank you so much for checking out the channel. If you guys want to see the opening for the EV Snorlax GX tins that I did posted today as well. It will be included in the suggested videos. But stay tuned for the Pikachu and Zekrom ones. That's the ones that we're going to be doing last. And man, am I excited to get into those. But thank you so much for watching. Um, let me know in the comment section below again which tins you guys have gotten and if you guys are planning on getting them. That is all for me today, guys. Make sure to smash that like button really to support the channel. We don't earn any money from YouTube. That's why you guys don't see any ads on these videos. So any support is appreciated. It helps YouTube promote our videos more. And, uh, and just let me know in the comment section below um, what you guys want to see. I am thinking of doing a giveaway. I still don't know what product it is, though. So still thinking on that. That is all for me today, guys. Hopefully you guys are having an amazing weekend and happy St. Patrick's Day, guys. See you in the next video.